welcome to my bookshelf. One of my favorite books of all times is Nelson Mandela's Long Walk to Freedom. I'm blessed to have the 1995 edition. Uh, it's one of the earlier editions of Mandela's autobiography. So as a student, I saw Mandela in person. Um, or just got a glimpse of him uh, when I was at Rhodes University in the 90s. Um, and I will never forget that day. Um, but this book, um, I've read it a couple of times over the last 10 years. Um, this book is such an insightful retelling of our country's history. It tells the story of Nelson Mandela growing up in the Eastern Cape as a child. Um, he takes us through a walk of him as a young man, of him as an attorney uh, working in Johannesburg, um, of his role in the ANC um, as a struggle stalwart. Um, and then later in the book, we also read about his trials and tribulations. What I love most about this book is that um, it is a history book. It's not just an autobiography. At the back of this book, there's an index, and um, you can read, go to the index if you don't want to read the whole book, but it gives you, for example, um, information on the Natives Representative Council, it talks about Bayer Nodir. It talks about um, various struggle stalwarts. It talks about Kodessa. It talks about you name it. I've read the book. I've seen the movie. And the book trumps the movie by far. So if you can lay your hands on a copy of this book, do get it. I recommend it. It is a great read written with passion and um, a sense of poetry. Nelson Mandela's Long Walk to Freedom.